hello and welcome back to our channel we all know that time sheets are used to record or track work done by employees so in odo it's possible to create time sheets upon time of validation that is odo automatically time sheets on projects or tasks upon time of request so let's see how this is done uh, first we have to go to app store and install time of and time sheet module so you can see time sheets and time of it's already installed now when you open time sheet go to configuration settings after activating developer mode you can see a uh, section time off there we can uh, enable time of record time of option so this creates time sheets upon time of validation that is uh, after validating the time of request so here it's possible to set a default project and task for the time sheet generated from time of request so let's open time of module and see how it works so first we can create uh, or configure time of type here we can see already some time of types are configured created okay let me open pay time off here we can see the details uh, you can see the location request time of request okay you can see it needs to be approved by uh, both employees manager and time of officer that is there is two step validation okay and below you can see section time sheet so this is used to uh, record time sheet so here also you can see for this time of type that is pay time of uh, project and task for time sheet is set so uh, when uh, time of is validated time sheet will be generated with this in under this project and with this task name okay so let's create a time of request Okay, from twenty June to twenty two June. Okay, here you can see duration is two days. Now we can save this and okay, overlaps. okay uh 27 june to 30 june okay so after saving uh can approve this so this needs a second approval now we can validate this so you can see this time of request is approved okay now so you can see the time of duration is three days now if you check timesheet, you can see our timesheet module. There we can see the recorded hours. You can see it from June 28, June 30. Uh, you can see a task is created uh, with the name time off. And here we can see uh, the time off is marked. You can see eight hours can see for 28 June, 29 June and 30 June. So total three days. So the time sheet is automatically generated from the time of request. And if you want to uh, see the details, you can just click on this. You can see all the records aggregated in this cell. So if you click this, you can see the date, uh, project name, task, then you can find the description, total time, Okay, so you can see this one is a time of. So this is how we automatically generate a uh, time of that is time sheet from time of request. So this feature is very helpful because it is not required to manually enter the time sheet for uh, time of request. 
and it does not leave place for forgetfulness and questions after hours that have not been time sheeted by the employee. So we have a better control over uh, the validation of time sheets. So that's all this video. And if you have any doubts related to this topic, you can add your comments below. And if you're looking for any order implementation or customization in your business, drop your request to odowatsybrosis.com.